All right, so let's start with the big story that we are tracking on Vyond at this hour. In the last 24 hours, have been described as the deadliest so far for India in the COVID-19 pandemic. Nearly about 5,611 new cases of COVID-19 infections were reported in the last 24 hours, taking India's overall tally of the number of infections to 106,700. So let's remind our viewers that this is the highest single-day surge in the number of cases. And interestingly, it comes at a time when the government is looking to ease the lockdown measures across the country. Now, on your screens is the graph that shows the daily surge in the number of cases. New cases in India have seen a rise by an average of more than 4,000 a day over the past week. The last three days have also seen an exponential rise in the COVID-19 infections in India. Now, India has also recorded more than 3,300 deaths so far, with 140 deaths having been reported in just the last 24 hours. So how many days did it take for India to reach the first 100,000 mark? Well, it took the country approximately about 62 days to reach the 100,000 mark. The growth rate of cases stands at about 5.1%, which is said to be one of the lowest in the world compared to that of the United States that has a growth rate of almost about 27%, reaching its 100,000 cases in just the first 25 days of the outbreak. Meanwhile, the country's doubling rate has also improved. It now is at 12 days so far. The country's fatality rate is also lower than the rest of the world, just about 3.1%. And more than 42,000 people have also recovered from the illness. So India's recovery rate stands at almost about 39%. Now, one third of all confirmed cases are from Maharashtra. Mumbai by itself accounts for more than half of all cases in the state. Now, India's national capital, New Delhi, is another big hotspot with more than 10,500 cases having been reported just from the national capital so far. Gujarat and Tamil Nadu also have more than 12,000 cases of confirmed COVID-19 infections. Now, even with the spike of cases in some parts of the country, a few Indian states, the smaller states such as Arunachal Pradesh, Mizoram, the Union Territory of Dadra and Nagar Haveli have reported just one case each.